This sounds like some weird Japanese businessman story. He's like, oh yes, I will win the heart of that young underage girl by doing something for her that she is too naive and too weak to be able to do. Oh shit, already? And that is they are. CIA mercs. Oh, it Thank makes sense why they'd be white guys. Them undetected. Avoid combat whenever possible. I'm wondering, does left and right... I'm, I'm going to be pressing the pad right now. I may end up accidentally doing something, but it's because in Snake Eater... This is a sneaking mission. Hide behind stuff. Take the long way around. Whatever it takes to stay out of sight. Your gun is a last resort. It could just as easily kill you as save you. The indicator in the upper right serves as a compass and shows sound sources. Pay attention to your surroundings. That's pretty neat, actually. All right, I have no Keep idea. Keep your eye on what's left of your life gauge on the left of the screen. To the right of that, you'll see your sight gauge. Exhausting it will inhibit your actions. Your life gauge will recover with time. The sight gauge too. You'll recover faster crouching than standing up. Lying flat works even better. All right, since I can no longer lie flat. All right, is that guy just standing still? I think he is. The percentage in the upper right is your camo index. That is the, the tiniest the number, fucking number. I can barely read that shit. Spotted. Conspicuous movements and loud noises will compromise your camo index. Your fatigues will act as camouflage. Unfortunately, you can't crawl this time around. Alright. I'm gonna try to, like, get behind this guy and try to, like, interrogate him. Might be able to get something. Start talking. Huh. Start talking. Huh. Start talking. Huh. This is so strange. Start talking. Huh. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah, I, I want to see if I can hear them without actually needing to grab them. Come on. Make your way east. No. Start talking. Huh. Start talking. Huh. Start talking. Huh. Alright. So make my way east. Alright. Uh, Puerto. Al Alba. Alright. Oh, Puerto del Alba. Alright. That's good that they actually try to give you, like, a rough map, even if it is a little. Actually, no. I think I think that's good enough. It kind of lets you know that there aren't too many things or whatever. Okay, Looks now. Looks like you're inside the compound. Security is tight. Stay sharp. Whoa, C dude. I know you like front bill and Kojima, but fucking hell, don't mess up the. Don't obscure my vision with your plane, with your name of sadness. Shit. I said stop doing that. Cardboard box? What are you gonna use that for? Oh shit, it's real time. Fuck. Crap. Okay, so th so I can't just pause. Shit. Uh. The love box. Oh god, I've seen like. There's like one mode later on. It. Ha! <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Okay, I'll admit. Okay. Oh shit, but th it disables my. It disables my my thing. My what is it called? Um the radar. All right, so this is a Japanese uh box where they would carry uh love pillows. Something I'd rather not have to think about. So, I'm just going to 
<laughs> Fuck. Oh my god. I got so fucking lucky here. Oh shit. Oh, I can't drag guys. I forgot. Oh shit. Start talking. Start so this talking. is how they get past uh Start talking. So that's how they get past uh having to actually use voices, I guess. You're looking for a two story building to the east. Yeah. How about the only two story building? That actually would be a very much more accurate one. Ah, uh, much more accurate description, alright. Shit. Oh! Fatigue. Actually, hold on. Do no, I don't get a choice of fatigues. Oh my god. So there's no camo strategies. Alright, I can't move while I'm... while I'm in this position. I'm hoping he doesn't see me. Yet. Having cr uh, cover as by holding a button actually does make a lot of sense to me. Uh, well, actually, since yeah, it actually makes a ton of sense uh, since uh, you can't move. In a lot of other games, it, it, the toggle makes sense because you can move, like in Uncharted or in in Gears. Uh, but here, if you can't move, it makes sense that you wouldn't. Infiltrate the facility on uh, the be east able side to, of the that, that it shouldn't be a toggle, it should just be like a holding down button, because it's like, alright, wait until now. Alright. Come on, sneak up very slowly, sir. I don't think I've gotten an alert yet. At least I don't hope I don't think I have. <laughs> Fuck. Alright. <laughs> Start talking. Huh? No. Start talking. Huh? Start okay, talking. then tell me huh? something, brother. Start talking. Actually, water is actually not that good of a conductor of electricity. Huh? It has enough resistance to the point where it actually starts to dissipate the electricity at a very large. Whoa! Oh my god. Oh crap! I didn't notice a door in there. Shit. All right. But yeah, if I'm not mistaken. Your objective is the building. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay. So that, that, I'm assuming that's the start of the mission. I don't think that's the whole thing. That would be weird if it was. Oh, l let me guess. The rest of it is cutscenes. Yes, sir. We broke them. We acquired the whereabouts of Target Five Zero Zero. Acknowledged. <laughs> The, the fuck was that? Acknowledged. Al. <laughs> oh. Oh! Quick time. What the fuck? Freeze. The cargo. Where's it headed? What is it? Air suit. In the mountains. What's up there? <laughs> Fuck quick time event. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> the fuck was that? You know, I, I was very forgiving towards Snake Eater because at least they went to the They went to the fucking effort of explaining things through like if you call Sigan at the right times. But are you fucking kidding me, brother? <laughs> like, the one that everybody pointed out was, um... What was it called? Um, the, like, the... those, uh... Floating platforms. Snake. Kaz, can you hear me? Loud and clear. You found a radio. It's got God, a look at that epic beard! Let's switch frequencies from time to time, just to make sure we're not detected. 
I've found a map of their bases. The cargo's heading from the marshes west towards Irasu. Nice going, boss. And Rathshelia is also is there. He just badges. went offline. Dozens of them. Film badges? Like the ones used to measure radiation exposure? Uh, the radio man was wearing one. And whoever he was talking to called the cargo Spears. Spear! Wait, Spear! 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 The yes. only wrestling fans are get that. They're bringing nukes into Costa Rica. Holy mother of God. My reaction would have been, ah, shit. So it's Paz Walker. Or Kaz Walker, depending on who Eric's going. Yeah, this would have been weird in Japanese. I mean, it, 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 like, having someone with an actual last first name, uh, Peace. Oh, my weapon use levels up? That's interesting, actually. What the fuck? I could have sworn I missed I missed one of the quick time events. What the hell? So heroism for what? I didn't use I barely used any of the items I had there, so What the fuck with these level ups? That's 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 interesting, but it kind of goes against a lot of the things I've already tried, so design specs, M one C rank one. Alright, gun smoke. Or smoke grenade, I should say. How's that map, Snake? Think you can use it? Uh, it tells me where their bases are, but it's just a bunch of points. No routes. I need better intel on the lay of the land. Snake, the professor said he's got the Sandinistas on his side. Said you should get in touch with the FSL and Commandante. Hmm. Do they know they're backed by the KGB? Nah. As far as they know, they're really fighting for the revolution. The KGB is staying behind the scenes. I'm not sure the Sandinistas are aware of what's really going on. Still can't believe anybody would bring nukes here. Yeah, that's a shocker. Costa Rica's party to the Tlatel Loco Treaty, which declares Latin America a nuke-free zone. Based on Japan's three non-nuclear principles, it bans the testing, use, import, or deployment of nuclear weapons. Those were four if things. If word of this gets out, Opinol will be forced to act. It'll cause an international uproar. The treaty was signed to prevent another Cuban Missile Crisis. If the U.S. itself is gonna scrap it... Latin America is too close to spawning another Cuba or two already. The entire continent would become one big powder keg. Well, it's, they it's really nukes, one and a half Can't let them get away with it. Are they planning a test? Showing that, off? Well, that depends. Or is really it all to keep the anti-American movement in check? Good question. Why bring them here? I can't figure it out. Whatever the CIA's up to in Costa Rica, the professor wants it stopped. We need to find out what that something is. We need to get ready first, Kaz. Repairs? Working as fast as we can, boss. This place is pretty beat. It looks like hell. But as long as you're with us, we'll make it heaven. No one can bother us here. No state telling us what to do. This is the MSF's haven, our mother base. And with this foothold, we'll back you up even better than before. We're gonna turn this pile of junk into something big. Alright, if I'm not mistaken, this was supposed to be a very deliberate visual cue towards the big shell in Metal Gear Solid 2. And, like, I think a map should come up for, like, the, the net missions you can attend. Alright, MSF Smother Base, alright. Okay, R&D. Oh! Oh, that's interesting, I can play against other people. I can form teams. Uh, th this I might do off screen, like, actually, ah, fuck it, whatever. Divided into several teams, including combat, R&D, and waiting. Dividing the teams and raising each level to be able to develop new weapons over time. Auto select. Hmm. Oh, this, is, this game actually has quite a number of different things in it. Uh, let's see. Okay. Well, Miller looks like he's the best at whatever that last thing is. Wait. No. 
Hey, what, what the hell? I can't put them on the box? Actually, what, what are these? Actually, now that I think about it. Uh... I really don't know what any of these are, actually. Yeah, fuck it, whatever. Since it's swords and... Alright, um... I, I'm going to be using a lot of the more straight up stuff, so... Let's see. What is this guy? This guy is R&D, so I'll put him there. And, whoa! Oh, okay. Alright. Uh, this guy is also R&D. R&D. Ah, fuck it. I'll just auto-select. What? Oh. Alright, all, th all that stuff didn't ac accidentally, like, create something absurd. Alright, I don't really know how any of this works, so let's see. Sure, why not? Develop weapons. Well, basically, you can develop your own items and weapons. Start developing weapons and items. You need GMPD. Our GMP. Okay. This is interesting. It actually creates kind of a, a game within a game kind of thing, and it's actually kind of cool. And I have some decent things. Mark 22. I'm assuming this is a. Um, the, oh, yeah, it's a, it's a. They have the ZCC. Yeah, it's a um, Trank gun. Yes. Okay. Assault rifle? Not really. I'm not interested in those. Snipe. Snipers I'm actually kind of interested in, but only in the ZZZ ones. As I said, I don't actually play most of the time. How the fuck can you... Ah, whatever. Uh, stun rod? Okay, they're not giving me any levels up on that one. I think it could be that, like, just, at, just upgrading anything will upgrade something, so... I, th I think the, the other one I could upgrade was grenades. Uh, I need to... I need to level up. Level up. Alright, items. Let's see what I got here. Rash. Oh, that would be fucking awesome if I could upgrade my rations. Oh, the Fulton Air System! Yeah, I heard about this. Alright. Uh, person recovery and evacuation system. Rec equip and move right near target. Press triangle to execute recovery. Okay, yeah, th is this how you, uh, is this how you can rescue, um... How do you upgrade a box? How does that happen? Um, well, let's see, th I, I think this is how you recruit more people. Actually, that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I can afford this. Analyze cube. Alright, what does this do, anyway? Oh, okay. I'm assuming nothing like moves ahead until I take missions on, so this could be in the situation where I have to grind missions, which could be interesting. I, well, as interesting as those things tend to be. Control documents? Oh, so these are key items. Alright, bullets. I can totally go that way! Oh, wait! Oh, that's cool, actually. The fact that Naked actually has a purpose. Like, it's not just worthless. All right. God, I am probably boring you guys to death. <laughs> All right, save data, transferring, uh, P the SP, like I have one. Uh, button config, title. And, all right, okay. I, I think that's gonna be it for today. Um, because I just got introduced, and I'm actually pretty interested. Th this has got me inter inter yeah, interested. Like, the thing, again, that is inhibiting my experience in this is the usual one with Metal Gear Solid, in that the cutscenes are too fucking long! But, uh, but whatever, I, I'll catch you guys later.